Whenever we talk to some people who consider themselves to be liberals, and in Islam we don't have liberals. We have Muslims and non-Muslims. So when someone comes and says, yeah, yeah, I'm a Muslim, but I'm a liberal Muslim. What is a liberal Muslim? If you're liberal, I'm conservative. What do you mean by liberal? It means that I have no problem with LGBT. I have no problem with homosexuality. I have no problem if people change their religions and flip from Islam to Hinduism or to Christianity. I have no problem with people having a, uh, 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 things that go against Islam, but it doesn't impact me. This is between them and Allah. So if someone opens a brothel, no problem. People have to have fun. If someone opens a bar, sells intoxicants, no problem. It's a free country. This is not liberalism. This is kufr, disbelief, because they're accepting other than Allah's sharia. And Islam is all about convictions. So those who say, whenever you talk to them about LGBT, for example, and that this is condemned by Jews, Christians, and Muslims. So all these religions consider that to be sinful. And it's a major sin. And they say, yeah, this is between them and Allah. Maybe, but also child molesting is between them and Allah. Also rape is between them and Allah. Stealing people's homes without them knowing and not being caught is between me and Allah. That does not justify it. That does not legitimize it. So we as Muslims have Quran and Sunnah that governs everything we do. It, they govern our convictions and beliefs. And as a Muslim, you do not have the right to condole or to endorse what such sinful people do by saying this is between them and Allah. Yes, it's true. Nobody told you to go and beat them up. But we tell you not to endorse it, not to be fine with it. They want to be uh, uh, LGBT on their own time and on their own uh, uh, place. That's their problem. You don't force me to go and socialize with them and normalize ties with them and think that what they're doing is their right and I have no objection, so I have to endorse it, invite them over to, 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 to dine in my home and maybe take my kids for the afternoon. No, you don't have the right to do that. I don't tell you to do anything harmful to them. This is their life, but we should call a spade a spade. And Allah Azza knows best.